The Queen Mother of Oni of Ife, His Imperial Majesty Oba Adeyeye Ogunwusi, is in pain as she was disrespected by two important people in her life, as Princess Toyi Kolade dishonored her invitation because of their history in the past. Just about two weeks ago, when Eleru Abiola threw a two-in-one party, her 27th birthday party and her installation as the Yeye Odua, Queen Mother of the House of Odudua, a title vested on her by the Oni of Ife, His Imperial Majesty, Oba Adeyeye Ugunwuse, Ojaja II. Many society, business and corporate bigwigs, as well as traditional rulers, attended the, attended the party. Besides the Oba of Lagos, Oba Akiolu, who did not attend the event, perhaps due to the fact that he was allegedly nursing an age-old grudge with Eleru Dosumu. One other prominent person who did not attend was Princess Toyin Kolade, the first Yaleje Udua. Many were surprised that she did not show up at the event as she and Eleru Dosumu both play vital roles in the house of Odudua. Besides, both titles were bestowed on them by the one and same person. The reason for her absence may not be far-fetched. Back in August 2021, a few weeks before her installation as Ijaleje Odua, the wealthy businesswoman had sent out carefully curated invitation cards packaged in beautifully designed boxes to prominent individuals expected to grace her high-profile event, which took place at the Oni of Ife's Palace. However, one thing that caught the eyes of those who received their invitation was the names of society matriarchs Eleru Dosumu and Senator Florence Itajiwa. This was surprising to many considering that the two women are prominent members of the Elders Club. Being in their 70s and very much older than the celebrant, listing their names as RSVPS was considered to be an anomaly. Besides being elderly, elderly meant that they no longer have the energy of a younger woman who would likely carry out such a task with vigor and favor. But even more surprising is the fact that the two women are not friends or even closely acquitted with Kolade in any way. The bubble soon burst when Erelu Dosumu in a strongly worded press release berated the celebrant for had adding her name as one of the RUSVPS without her consent and requested that it be removed. Ironically, why Itajiwa neither acknowledged the RUSVP nor attended the installation party, a little do Dosumu attended much to the shock of many. So when it was the turn of Eleru Damsu party, many took out, looked out for Kolade who was no show. Why some believed Eleru Dosumu did not extend an invitation to her. Others were of opinion that Kolade was perhaps not readily available to attend the party. <laughs>